No fewer than 700 persons in Edo State have been trained on providing basic life support in the case of cardiac arrests that have most times resulted in sudden death. The training which took place in Benin City, the state capital, is organized by the University of Benin Teaching Hospital in a bid to put participants through on how to perform a cardiopulmonary emergency on patients. On their part, the participants uh, lauded the management of the institutions for coming up with such initiatives, noting that the training will indeed prepare them ahead of daily emergencies. Most times, this is supposed to be a basic thing in any society where indigenous of, the, of society are supposed to know how to respond when somebody drops and collapses. So that's why we are here. We decided to target about 600 to 700 personnel drawn from different organizations for us to give them awareness and train them on basic life support. As you can see, we mounted about 15 stations where our paramedic and medical officers are here training them on what to do when in medical emergencies. First, let me commend the management of the University of Benin Teaching Hospital, UBTH, for this exercise. Journalists are also first responders. First responders in the sense that we want to capture the news first. But while capturing the news, UBTH is of the opinion that we have to be sure that the life of the people you are meeting is safe. You too have to be sure that you that are discovering it, you are also safe. And that's why this life support training is very important. It will go a long way to help resuscitate an unconscious soldier in the sense that it gives the soldier, the ordinary soldier that is not a medical personnel, that knowledge, that knowledge to resuscitate an unconscious soldier. So by that doing, it will save life. Those of us who are X-Men, we are always on the road and we are prone to these accident issues. Today, about 30 of us have been taught on how to conduct CPRO, which can resuscitate, which can bring back somebody's life. It is very important and we are grateful to University of Benin Teaching Hospital. I know that this they have done today will impact on their do state citizen in the long run. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.